Hi guys and welcome to another Ignite. These weeks are rolling through. It's good news because it's getting lighter outside and we're getting closer to freedom. I'm closer to seeing you guys again. But the weeks are absolutely flying by. Thank you so much for coming to join us today. We have a fun, a fun uh, Ignite plan for you today. And Lucy, we have another guest. Who is that? We Who do is have our guest? a very special guest. Another guest that, can you believe it or not, was it Ignite? when she was in primary school. It's and not it even funny, is it? On the Ignite team. <laughs> it's crazy. She is Beyond awesome. the joke. She is a lovely, lovely person. She loves being with you guys. She's funny. She's so helpful. And we are so glad that she's able to join us, aren't we, Deb? Yes, I'm so excited. Let's call her in. Six and a half hours later. Grace, it is Grace Dukes, Luce. How cool is this? So We've cool. got Grace with us today. And Grace, me and Luce were just talking before you came on. You spent a year at Ignite as one of the children. It's crazy. And now, like, she wears the red lanyard with us. It yeah. is weird and it makes us feel <laughs> old. We don't like it, but we love it at the same time. We're so happy that you've come to join us. But yeah. every guest that we have on Ignite has to do, has to answer two questions before we start playing again. The first question, Tell us something interesting about yourself. You've, you, you're an interesting girl. Tell us something that's interesting about you. Um, okay. And when I wake up, I take them out and I can see perfectly. Wow. No way. <laughs> For real? <laughs> that is so cool. How does that I'm work? Actually I'm actually a bit stunned. How did... Wait, so, okay, let me get this right. You have contacts, right? You put yeah. them in when mm -hmm. you go to sleep. Yeah. And then it, there's like magic elves in your eyes that fix your eyes <laughs> all day. Yeah. And then you so wake cool. up in the morning, you take them off, you can see. Yeah. How awesome is that? What a good invention. Whoever made that. That is so it's cool. Like... <laughs> I love Me it. and Luce rarely have nothing to say. This yeah. stunned silence is a first. Because Grace, <laughs> I'm sitting here wearing glasses. If I take them off, it looks like it looks like I pour water in my eyes if I take them off. Everything <laughs> looks underwater. How do I get those? <laughs> I think my optician's been holding out on me. I need to go talk to my optician because like I don't want to wear glasses. <laughs> so that is an interesting fact, Grace. That is up there with some of the most interesting facts yeah. we've heard. I love that. And I'm going to tell, awesome. I'm going to tell my sisters, because we all wear glasses, that this exists. Because <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's just, it's a hard life wearing glasses. Yeah. Okay, yeah. right, sorry, I have to ask you the next question, or we're going to spend the whole evening talking about that. Yeah. <laughs> next question. We are in lockdown number three, I believe, even though it feels like number 12. We're in lockdown number three. What have you learned, either about yourself or about God, or what have you taught yourself to do? Have you picked up a new skill since the lockdowns started? Um, I've probably learned that friends mean a lot, but then mm. I've learned that I can live in my pajamas. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Can't we all? They're so comfortable. Can't we? Like, I'm not going to stand up because nobody needs to see that, but I currently have Arsenal pajama trousers on right now. Oh, no. <laughs> and I've been at work all day. And those are the trousers that I've been wearing. I've had appointments wow. with children wearing Arsenal pyjama trousers. You are absolutely right, Grace. There is no need for jeans. Like, no. I've realised there is no need. <laughs> I was wasting my time. Comfortable all the time. <laughs> and it's also so true about friends. Friends do. Yeah, definitely. definitely. Yeah. Can't yeah. Love that one. I realised how much of my life socially revolves around my friends. Because when I couldn't see them, I was like, Oh, what am I doing? Yeah. Oh, Grace, that's a fantastic lesson. Thank you for sharing those with us. Love that. I like the pajama one. So do I. So do I. <laughs> right, so now it is time for our game. And this game we're going to call I Spy slash What Am I Thinking? Are you ready? Amazing. Yes. I'm excited. So, seeing as we're all in different places and we can't really see what each other what each other can see, what we'll do is pick a category or a place. So, I think we should go with bedroom, seeing as we're all at home. Does that yeah. make sense? Yes. All right. Would anyone like to volunteer to go first? 
I didn't okay, should, should I do a practice round with me really quick yeah. so we can get it? So it's like an I spy, mm. but in my mind. Yeah. Okay, it's like I spy in my mind. So, yeah. I spy with my little eye, bedroom category. Yeah. Something beginning with B. Bad. A bag. No. no. Oh, Greg's we're wrong. <laughs> No, not a bed. Um, it has the, it has, okay, I'll give you a clue. It has bed in it, but it's not a bed. Uh, bedside table. Bedside table is what I was after, Lucy Cook. See, that's the answer I was after. So, that's a practice that makes round, sense. doesn't count, but you guys were thinking clearly. You you were you were thinking well. Okay, Lucy. Okay, so now we don't have to do it. Should I go first properly? Yeah, may as well. All right, cool, right. I spy with my little eye, Something else beginning with B. There she being sneaky, Grace. Mm, I am. <laughs> Have you got an idea? <laughs> I'm gonna say bed. No, that's not bed. Oh, I thought you were gonna be sneaking, but yeah, bed. That would have been a good idea, actually. But no, yeah. I'm not being sneaky. Eh. <laughs> uh... You might find this item on the bedside table. A book. A book! Well done! I have oh, great. No idea. A book. I like to read before bed. Yeah. So there's always a book on or in my bedside table. I'm, to try I'm not and looking get around my room like what? And I actually have a book on my table, like. See, <laughs> you've got a book on your bedside yeah. table, right? Everybody does. Yeah, that's funny. Or, or a book that you act like you're gonna read, but you're not really gonna read. Okay, so that's my turn. Uh, Grace, do you want to go next? Um, okay, um, I spy with my little light something beginning with P. Picture. No. Pajamas. Oh. No. Oh. Oh. Painting. No. Plant. No. Oh, is your dog in there? Pepper. No. <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh, this is not easy. What else um, begins with P? I can't think. Picture frame. you got paper in there. No, it says not a picture frame or a piece of paper. No. Piano. No. <laughs> well, Grace has a piano in her bedroom. <laughs> you never know. <laughs> oh, no, uh, no, wait. Oh, oh Lucy, you're being ridiculous. Pillow. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that's embarrassing. Lucy, you're going to have to edit that. <laughs> that's embarrassing. Pillow. I Think of pillows straight away. Of course, we have pillows in our bedrooms. How silly! I didn't. I don't know what I was thinking. No wonder Grace was laughing at us. I know. <laughs> okay. Well, now kids, you know everything in a room that could start with a P, because <laughs> we and Lucy said everything <laughs> except for pillow. Okay, pillow. Uh, oh, that was a good one, Grace. You had us. I'm going to tell Lucy to edit that so we don't get made fun of. <laughs> okay. okay. Go on, Lucy. What, what about you? Okay. I spy with my little eyes something beginning with C. You might get this joke. Yeah. yeah. A cup. Nope. I've always it's got enough. a cup. That's my yeah. bad habit. There's always a cup on my bedside table. It's horrible. You know what? I've broken that habit. I always make sure How to you take do that? my cup down. How? Every morning I'm just like, I need to take that down. Yeah, I just I, I just think I was just like, no, enough is enough. It needs to go downstairs every morning so i do now i've broken the habit it's possible okay in the morning i'm gonna try that in the morning when i go downstairs i'm gonna be like right i'm dressed cups, cups downstairs. downstairs yeah cool i do that for the office as well i saw that sorry we completely got sidetracked so guys have you got any other ideas for sleep <laughs> uh, not at all oh, i don't know so it's not a cup she can't win grace <laughs> <laughs> or can i um, I know. Um, curtains. No, don't have curtains. I thought you didn't have curtains, but I thought, what else begins with C? I don't like this. Think about it. Candle. Yes! Candle, Candle you're oh, correct! Come on, Grace. Yes. I was about to say chair next. Candle's here, behind me. I've got a chair oh, as well. That's 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 well done, Grace. Clever. That was hard. Honestly. One. She, oh, honestly, God. Grace figured out both of ours. And then she had the yeah. hardest one because we couldn't figure it out. Yeah. 
I think Grace won that, don't you? I, yeah, Grace, you are the winner of our I Spy game. I couldn't. That was embarrassing, Deb, on our part. That was extreme. Like we're gonna, we're gonna get made fun of for that, but it's okay because <laughs> we got there in the end. We got there in the end. Oh, so, right. so kids, you can literally. I would play that game in the car when we got bored with my yeah. mum and my sisters. When we got bored of playing I Spy, we just said, "What item am I thinking about?" The only rule was you're not allowed to make up items because my little sister used to be like three-headed alien. And we're like, how, how are we, that's not fair. So when you play, make sure it's an actual real item that exists, okay? Yes. But have a great time playing that. Hopefully we'll be allowed on some road trips soon. So that is a road trip game that we've just given you. Uh, okay, so, Grish, you just bossed the I Spy game, <laughs> but I have another question for you. Okay, let's see if you can get this one. Has there been, a song or a scripture, like, scripture is such a fancy word. If you don't know what scripture means, it's literally just words in the Bible. That's what it means. <laughs> I don't know why we say scripture. But do you have a scripture or a song that you think, yeah, this has got me through lockdown. This has made lockdown easier. Or you feel like you don't feel as hopeless when you listen to it. Um, a song would probably, it'd be Run To The Father. Oh, who's that? Back? Who sings that? Cody, someone. Oh, Cody Asprey. Co okay. Cody Asprey. Oh, he's brilliant. He sings "Reckless Love." Yeah, if that's the guy you're on about. <laughs> yeah, Cody. I'm I think it's Cody Asprey. That. Yeah, I'm gonna find it. Look it up and have a listen. Oh no, no, it's not. I think it's Cody Khan's "Carrie Jones." <gasps> that's it. Might be that person. I think that's the one. Yeah, I think it's kids. We've got that wrong. I, I've just had a look. It's Cody Carnes who sings that Cody song. Calms. Why has that song helped you, to you, uh, Grace? Um, I think it's just like it's helped me take all my troubles to God and mm. realise that it's not all bad and it's going to get. Yeah. <laughs> I love that. Yeah, you are absolutely right, Grace. Even though we've whinged a lot, haven't we? We've complained a lot. Yeah. But it's not all bad, is it? No. Oh, that's, oh, that's awesome. brilliant. So, kids, that was run. To, oh, that made me quite emotional. Kids, that that is um, "Run to the Father" by Cody Carnes. I will be turning that on immediately after we finish filming <laughs> to, to have a listen to it. Yeah. Oh, thanks, Grace. Thank you. Well, can you believe it? Ignite has come to the end already. We've had so much fun, and that's gone so fast. But <laughs> we are. So glad that you guys have joined us for another Friday night at Ignite. We've had great fun playing our spies and seeing Grace, who we haven't seen for such a long time. We're so glad you, that you've joined us. And I bet you, you're probably way much taller than you were when we left. I bet she Way is. back in March, God. <laughs> yeah. I'm already small and all these kids growing up, man. <laughs> <laughs> it's all right, Grace. Being tall is great. You can be tall like me. It great. is. What? Nice. <laughs> you girls are. Um, but no, seriously, thank you all for joining. We hope you have a great week and we will see you all next Friday. Bye. Bye. Take care, guys. Bye. <laughs>